What's up? Today I'm going to teach you five easy tricks to do on a pyramid, like a hip like this, anything bank hipped. So let's get started. And this is going to be like over the hip, so not on the flats of the bank. So first is a 90 to fake. All you have to know is how to 180. This is a real easy one. You just ride up on the pyramid, hop 90 degrees, kind of like jump to the side that you're spinning towards, land fakey, and roll away. That's a real easy one, real simple. Um, but you can add a bunch of stuff to that. You can add bars into it. You can add, you know, tug no handers, whips, whatever eventually. But that's, that's a fun one. Uh, next trick is the 270. It's taking that spin and then going a whole nother 180. So if you spin left, you're gonna go to the right. And if you spin right, you're gonna go to the left. So you'll ride up the ramp, kind of on an angle to start, especially because it'll be a little bit easier to go in that direction. So you try to ride as straight up as possible and you'll spin, as you get to the top, you're gonna jump to the side that you're gonna land in, jump towards that and spin the other way. So I'm gonna jump right and spin left. So you do that, spin. You can kind of do more of like a 180 too. You don't have to like land, you don't have to land perfectly 270 in order to roll away. So you ride up, when you get to the top, you're gonna jump to the side that you're going into, spin, land, and you wanna try to dip it a little bit, especially on a steeper hip, that way you don't loop out. But yeah, so that's that's 270. And then there's a whole bunch of tricks that, you, that can open up from there. Once you learn them on here, you can do them on like quarter hips, stuff like that. So the next one, kind of like a 90, you're gonna do the 90, but um, this one's gonna be a foot jam 90 to fakie. So instead of just hopping into 90, you're gonna roll up to the top, do your foot jam, and then spin your back end over, and then hop out of the foot jam, land fakie, and roll away. So that one's a real easy one. You can eventually start to hop into your foot jam and hop out of it, or for right now, start now, you can just roll into the foot jam and then turn and then roll out into fakie. Uh, so that's an easier trick. So the next trick is gonna be like our second one, which is the 270, but you're gonna do it to fakie. So you're gonna come the opposite way. So on the 270, I would go this way. On the 270 to fakie, I would come this way. So it's basically like a 180, and you can do it exactly like a 180. You can carve it this way and then land not straight. So you can like, you can cheat it a little bit. So you can just do like a 180 over it, land, and then eventually when you get better, you can start straight and then end straight, and you'll eventually go this 90 degrees as opposed to like a straight angle. And then that'll help doing that over like quarter hips, stuff like that, and you can do a bunch of tricks into that as well. Now our last trick is gonna be one more spin added, and that is the 450. So you're gonna spin the exact same way that you did doing the fakie, the 270 to fakie, and you're gonna spin a whole nother 180. And this is basically like a 360, and then eventually when you get better at it, you can spin the full 450. So you can start on that angle, and then land on that angle doing a full 360, and then eventually you'll start straight, land straight, and that'll give you that full 450 degree turn. But with this, you're just gonna wanna pop a little bit harder, go a little bit higher. You don't have to worry about going much faster, but you wanna get up in the air to give you more time. And then with this, it's like a 360, but you're gonna dip it. Since you're already leaning back, you don't wanna just do the 360 because you'll land back heavy and loop out. So you wanna lean forward, kind of dip the front end. That way you can land in the transition and roll away. So those are five of my beginner easy-ish tricks to do on a hip. If you know some easier ones, let me know if you have some more favorite tricks that you like to do on hips. I'll do more videos. This is just part one, so keep an eye out for part two, maybe a part three. They'll probably get more advanced as we go, but this is part one. If you like videos like this, click that thumbs up button. If you, uh, if you have any other suggestions for videos, comment those below. And if you like this content and don't wanna miss out on future content, click the subscribe button. Uh, yeah, go follow Hager Clothing on Instagram. Site will be active soon if it's not already, so go check that out. Support the brand if you like. And yeah, thanks so much for watching. Once again, we'll see you next time. Goodbye.